you won't be able to believe what some medieval Europeans used Egyptian mummies for. In the 15th century, embalmed bodies were not only subjects of fascination in historical study, but forms of medicine. For more than 500 years, medieval Europeans consumed Egyptian mummies to soothe stomach aches, relieve headaches, and cure diseases. So how did this even happen? During the 11th century, Europeans stumbled upon the Arabic term mummia, a substance found on a Persian mountainside that seeps from black rock asphalt. Containing healing properties, this substance was used for a variety of medical purposes and was soon discovered by Europeans via Islamic texts. Translators identified the term mummia as a healing substance exuded from preserved Egyptian mummies. Although some Egyptian mummies were indeed embalmed with asphalt, Europeans associated mummia with the embalmed bodies themselves, not the asphalt. Soon enough, European medical practitioners began prescribing mummia for headaches, heart attacks, and nearly every other ailment. A mummy-stealing frenzy ensued, with Egyptian tombs being ransacked by body snatchers left and right. The demand for Egyptian mummies quickly exceeded its supply, leading to body snatchers collecting and embalming criminals and slaves to sell to medical practitioners. Once acquired, the mummies were dried out in ovens, ground into powders, and then mixed into medicines. Unbelievably, these practices continued for over five centuries until skepticism arose about mummia. Should I discuss other similar historical medical practices? Let me know in the comments.